Well, hello, a very warm welcome to you for this evening's game. Regrettably, the weather has been extremely unkind to us here. It is wet and blustery and remarkably inhospitable. Despite all of that, it is good to see that the faithful from both sides have apparently been undeterred. We have a terrific turnout here. The atmosphere is bubbling despite these adverse conditions. All we need now is for the game to live up to its initial filling. So what a stage for the players to take to here ahead of such an important game. Jim, who do you reckon is pivotal? Yeah, Lorenzo Insigne. One thing he excels at is cutting inside from that left wing, Peter, to take a shot with his right. He's far from a one-trick pony, though, and he's really good at varying his game depending on how the opposition are, are shaping up. Usually, he finds space and he does something very good with it. Yeah, he'll be looking for a goal or two. We have already started here. Mario Rui, Lorenzo Insigne, Lorenzo Insigne, and he's whipped it in low, goes for goal, what a wonderful goal, it's hardly a surprise is it, that's what we're here for, a player with this wonderful knack of being able to show up and deliver at important times, yet, yet another example. No fluke, it's what he was there for. Well, as they say, Peter, if you don't speculate, you won't accumulate. And we've just witnessed a player who was rewarded for his willingness to take a risk, as cunning as it comes. Napoli take the lead, landing the first significant blow in what is certainly a significant contest. Oh, look, this is just what the fans wanted. And now that they're celebrating the opener, I think they'll want to see their team make all the running from here. Oh, that's neat. Gets away from his opponent. Torino were imperious when the two... So yeah, he's fouled him there. He's trying the shot. A really good feat. Gets the better of his man. Timely intervention. Fabian Ruiz. Napoli are already ahead. The perfect start. What a good start to the game. I think their play has been fast and inventive, and, and this is a fine example of early intent. They've begun as they mean to go on, and another goal is on the cards. And Saldi has been included in the starting 11 for the first time in some weeks. And it's Insigne. Mertens already, of course, on the score sheet. Oh, we're checking back like that, always appreciated by the crowd. You have to admire commitment like that, because he could easily ignore that and just kind of walk around and let others do all the chasing, but instead, he looks as if he relishes the chance to, uh, to dig in for his team here. Hoists it forward. And here's Mertens. Chance! He's looking to get there first.
Di Maria. Hakimi. Played out to the right. And he heaves it forward. Napoli have it back and they can go again. There has been just the early goal here. And the score is 1-0. Mario Rui has come steaming up from the back for this. Fabian Ruiz. Kunu is there to heave it away. Lovely bit of skill there. Iniesta, Mario Rui, looking to break out here, Belotti in his previous fixture, open the scoring, turning it across, truthfully it was hard to see any better outcome there, And it's Pelotti. Gorgeous control there. And here's Zaza. Oh, super tackle. They were outnumbered and under the cosh. That had to be spot on, and it was. He gets past his man. Insigne plays it into the box. Whistle for half time. And there we are, off they go for half time. The victory did indeed come in the first half. And there has only been that one goal, which is very, very tight. I'm sure they'll be very happy with the first half performance and the scoreline. They'll definitely want to maintain the momentum now and finish the job. Napoli come in, having established that lead. A game where the narrative is, at least in terms of the scoreline, so far so good. Just back from your break, you've missed very little of the resumption of the second half. Napoli going well here, and they're in a good position to kick on and add to their lead. They don't have to overcommit, but they can place more emphasis on stretching their advantage without necessarily neglecting things defensively. Di Maria, Mertens, Iniesta. Fabian Ruiz, Hakimi gets into a good position. Up to meet it! Oh, no, that's not the ball he wanted. Torino were grateful to the genius of their manager last time round. Yeah, he had a problem, but he was confident he had the players to fix it, and his willingness to take risks is what I liked, and that worked an absolute treat. Hakimi tries to get it forward quickly. And it's Mertens. Di Maria provides an outlet. And that's been lever clear. Well, it's a safety in numbers approach to defending here. Insignia with a shot! Knocks it away. That's just very well played. He can't hurt you with his back to goal. And he didn't go for the back heel. Lorenzo Insigne. Cross deflected over the goal line for a corner. Ah, <laughs> oh, now some movement on the bench, and we are going to see a change. Merton's being applauded off here, having made a sizable contribution. I think he's put in a good shift, and, and their fans appreciate that. I think he could feel pretty happy with the, the contribution he's made. Napoli making another change here. So it's going to be another corner. But there's going to be another change here. And it's hoisted clear.
Mitty. Zaza needed to come up with a better ball. Oh, that just required a bit more oomph to reach its target. Bellotti, and he's away. Chance to break. Striding, and the shot! A real chance and a real let-off. OK, it's come to nothing, but it's a warning of further threat on the break. Torino are making a change now. Well, you have to feel a little for the player being taken off here. I think he's been made the scapegoat after that, but I guess something had to be done. I suppose it did need a little change. Velotti battles to win it back. Fabian Ruiz was not to be moved. Walk forward. What does he cry from here? Going through. Danger averted for now. <laughs> The changes then in quick succession. Insignia with a shot! Big relief, it just needed better contact. Oh, look, I don't want to sound too dismissive, but from here, that looks the harder thing to do. Lovely bit of skill. Fabian Ruiz is onto it and can take it up. That's it! Oh, he couldn't get the direction he needed. Torino can defend those situations better by stopping the crosser at source. And here's Insigne. Fabian Ruiz. Napoli can afford to settle on seeing this one out by running down the clock, I think. And it's Insigne. This could spell danger. Napoli probably could have killed things off, but they should be OK here. He's got away. Deftly done. He's got options out wide. There will be four extra minutes. It is just a question of running down the clock now. Maselli. Verdi. Untidy challenge, free kick given. And there goes the final whistle. What a game. End to end, it flew by, and in the end, it all came down to just the odd goal. Your reflections then, Jim. Well, to me, this is a result, Peter, that says an awful lot more than the scoreline suggests. You know, after the goal, the team just settled down and, and looked surprisingly comfortable and didn't really need to work too hard. Thanks to Jim. We both wish you a very good evening.